Hey guys, so this is how you take an Illustrator file, bring it into Photoshop, turn it into a 3D model that you can then print on your 3D printer. So that's what I'm gonna do. So you take this, I have this simple outline here, simple drawing in Illustrator. You can see all the backgrounds, everything's removed. So you take that and you go up here to File, Export, Export As, and this is an SVG. So we're gonna name this Extrude Example. It's gonna be SVG. And we're going to hit export. That's all good. You don't need to worry about any of that, really. Then you go over to Photoshop, and I'm using an i3 Mega, so I got the dimensions set over here. And make sure you set it to millimeters. I guess it doesn't really matter the size that you have. You're just trying to extrude it. So hit create, and you guys go down and get your file. So we extrude example, and you drag it into your Photoshop canvas or your document. So now that you get this, you go up to 3D new 3d extrusion from selected layer let it do its thing turn into a 3d model and there you go we're just going to turn it. it looks a little dark right now because it's a thick extrusion but you can see if you turn it here it extruded pretty nicely so then you go up here to properties you can also right click but it's fine it's easier to go over here and then click on this one right here which is deform and then extrusion depth right here you can select the depth that you want it so I'll just do five millimeters and it's already set up to millimeters because we already did it. So now you can see it changed to five millimeters. You got that. So now you go back up top to 3D. You put export 3D layer, changes from a Collada DAE into an STL. All oh, that's good. You can't change anything. Go right here, export it there. I just click that so we can change the name, STL. So we'll go over here to Cura. We're gonna open up the file and comes in here and there you go and there's your 3d extruded file from illustrator to photoshop